I really tried to sit in front of my tree, but the lighting was so bad because the window's right there and I had the window behind me. Backlighting does not work, especially on this camera. So, there's no tree in the background, but it's right there, I promise. <laughs> And this is my what I got for Christmas video. Obviously, I'm not trying to brag, and I'm extremely grateful for everything I got. So this is Christmas morning with my mom, my grandma, and my sister. Later, we go to Christmas dinner with my dad and my cousins, and we're exchanging gifts at my dad's house later, but I don't have those yet, so I'll probably film the next part of this video later tonight. I just wanted to film this right now so I have time. Also, I'm seeing my cousins on my mom's side Friday, so I'll probably get more gifts then because we're exchanging gifts then as well. But I might just throw those gifts into a random vlog and you can see them then. I don't know. It's just overall complicated. We're getting cozy. I obviously love filming these videos and love watching them. Have my Christmas pajamas on. Have my hot chocolate ready. We're just going to get started. First, we're going to start with my stocking, as always. This is fun, because we actually got new stockings this year. Um, look like this, and it's candy canes, and that's my first initial. And we all have matching ones. So the first thing that's like popping out of my stocking are these party wafers. They're vanilla wafer cookies. These are so bomb. Wafer cookies are just so good. I have this mini travel clear tub and I also got the not your mother's beach babe hair stuff I have a frosted coconut snowball room spray if you watched my college vlogs you know how obsessed me and my roommates are with room sprays so love to add to that collection the next thing in here is a perfume and it's the Clinique happy perfume my mom bought it for me because it's orange I go to Tennessee and orange is a new favorite color of mine. A hint of citrus, a wealth of flowers, Clinique Happy, a mix of emotions, wear it and be happy. We believe Clinique Happy is a daily delight. Enjoy it often, don't save it. So it's just kind of like a really like dainty kind of citrus slash flower smell. Next thing, got a lottery ticket. We get these every year. Hopefully I win a million dollars. Oh, you can only win up to 500 thousand but like still hopefully I win the next thing is a game it's like a card game called say it the game of crazy combos it's the frantic party game where combinations lead to laugh out loud answers and the last thing in here is a Kylie Jenner lip kit and this is in the shade candy K so that's everything in my stocking by the way you should all go follow me on TikTok because before I filmed this video I made a Christmas TikTok and I was sweating. So follow me on TikTok. It's down below in the description. I'm very excited about this gift. If you have never seen one of my videos before, you should probably know that I'm a major One Direction fan, Harry Styles fan. His new album came out December 13th, and so I knew there was going to be a vinyl, and I got a record player like three or four years ago for Christmas, and now it's like my favorite gift to get is like a new record for my record player. So I asked for Harry Styles' album on vinyl, and I got it. And this album, swear to God, gets better and better every time I listen to it without fail. It's so good. I have friends that have never liked Harry Styles' music, and now they love him, so. This next few items all kind of go together. If you've been watching my videos, you know how into skincare I am just because I have really sucky skin. So I'm trying to make it better at all times. And lately I've been trying to get into like a routine for my skin. It's a big thing, probably going to have to go on Accutane anyway, but I still love doing all skincare things. My motto for 2020 is self-care. So I asked for the Mario Badescu facial sprays, and I already have the blue and the pink one, but you can never have too many, but I've never had the green one and I've always wanted it, so I got these two mini ones. And then another skincare item I asked for that I've wanted for a long time is a face roller. So I got a jade roller, and I'm very excited about this. So I got this one, and I got the normal jade roller, and I'm so excited to use this and just roll my face out. 
And then the last skincare item I got is actually a bigger one, and I've wanted one of these for months. I got a skincare fridge! So the one I got is light blue, and this is a gift I'm so grateful for, and I can't wait to take it back to school with me. Can't wait to put all my new products and old products in this fridge. Oh, also forgot to mention, my mom got us all matching pajamas, but only my sisters and mine came because I guess they ran out of the sizes for my mom and my grandma. But these are the matching pajamas, so these were a Christmas gift as well. I also got these really pretty earrings, and they're just like these little wreaths. And I wore them last night to church, and they're so stunning. I'm probably going to wear them to dinner too. I just like the way they like hang down. Sticking to jewelry, my sister was extremely generous. I had no idea she was doing this. I opened this little bag. I was like, okay, it must be jewelry. So I open the bag and then I pull out a little red box and it's Cartier. So she actually got me a gold Cartier ring. And I have puny fingers, so I'm gonna have to wear it on my pointer finger. My thumbs are actually smaller than my pointer finger, which is weird, but really pretty ring. Thank you to my sister. My cousins and aunt in California uh, shipped us a gift that me and my sister share, but they've gotten us this gift every year for like 10 years at least. So we got Just Dance 2020. Just Dance is so fun. So excited to play this. I actually also asked for these on my Christmas wish list, if you saw that video. And they're just some blue light glasses because I'm on my laptop constantly with school and YouTube and editing and just watching Netflix and stuff like that. And I have good eyesight. Not trying to brag, but like I don't wear glasses, never needed to go to the eye doctor or anything. And then I started realizing how bad the blue light is for your eyesight. And I just don't want to damage my eyes when I don't have to. So I got a pair of these. They're a little funny looking when I don't have makeup on. Um, but they actually look pretty good when I do have makeup on. I think they only look weird on me without makeup. Is because with like my acne and the glasses, I just look like a complete like geek. But like when I look good and put together, they actually look decent on. But they're going to protect my eyes. So it doesn't really matter if they're cute, but that's what they look like. Okay, so the next thing I got is actually some Lululemon. And everyone knows Lululemon is the best, but so expensive. And we don't like that. So I usually ask for Lululemon for Christmas just because I can't buy it for myself. So this year I asked for leggings and sports bras. Normally I just ask for leggings, but I'm trying to get more into working out. So I thought getting cute workout clothes would really get me in the spirit. So I just got a plain black pair of leggings. They're the Align High Rise and they're the 25 inch because I'm a short little person. Love these, already have a pair of them, obsessed with them. Now I have three pairs of Lululemon black leggings, but you know what? Three will never be enough. You know, a hundred would never be enough. You just wear them constantly. And then I also got this super cute sports bra in this pinkish purple type color. And it just looks like this with some crisscrosses in the back. So I'm excited for those to bring to college so maybe I get my butt in the gym. Of course, once my ankle is fully healed, because it's still not. The last gift I have in this pile was also something I've been wanting for a while. So I saw these on Emma McDonald's channel on YouTube and she is obsessed with them. And I didn't know these existed till I saw her video. The taller Uggs look really doofy on me. I think it's because I'm so short. They just look like they don't fit my body. So I really only wear my Ugg moccasins and my Ugg like boots are huge. And I got them years ago so kind of time for a new pair but they actually make mini uggs i don't know if you knew this you probably did because you haven't been living under a rock i asked for a pair of mini uggs just because i think they look so good with like leggings and with someone of short stature it doesn't make you look all that short so i got these ones they're in the moleskin color i believe i put three colors on my list and said surprise me and so this is the color i got and they're super cute i love them and I can't wait to wear them. The mini ones are so much cuter. Isn't everything mini cute? I mean, come on. I meant to film the second part of this video yesterday, but when I got home, I 
I was too tired and I just completed 24 days of uploading in a row. So I gave myself yesterday off. Sue me. I didn't get my what I got for Christmas haul up Christmas Day. It's going up the next day. Sorry. But I did go to my dad's. Well, we went to dinner and then I went to my dad's to exchange gifts. So I got a few more things for my dad and my cousin on his side. So I'm just going to show you those quickly and wrap up this video. I've been wanting this for a while. I specifically asked for this. I'm so grateful for it because if you've been watching Vlogmas, you know that my camera is being held together by tape. So I got a new camera and I'm so stoked. So this is the Canon G7X Mark III. And it's very aesthetically pleasing to look at. Like, tell me that's not stunning. And it has a flip-up viewfinder, which is amazing because the camera I'm on now doesn't... It has a viewfinder, but it doesn't flip up or down. It just stays facing the back, so I never really know if it's on me completely or not. But now I'm going to have to get used to not looking in the viewfinder, but that's fine. But it's just so pretty, and I'm so excited about this. I think I'm going to use it today to vlog. I'm going to the city with some friends, so I'll probably bring it and have a fun vlog for you guys. Say goodbye to this camera. My videos are going to look a little different. Hopefully, they're going to look a lot better. And I think my dad got it off Amazon because he got a bunch of stuff to go with it that I think, like, all came together when he ordered it. So I got a case for it. I also got a tripod for it. I actually already have a tripod on this camera, so now I have two mini tripods, and I also have a big tripod, so that's fun. Um, a high-quality 2-in-1 lens cleaning pen. A Ritz Gear 5-piece deluxe cleaning kit. Micro HDMI to HDMI cable. I also got a memory card, but that's already in the camera. Universal LCD screen protector. I didn't even know this was in here, so I guess... I can put this on the viewfinder so it stays protected, hopefully. Oh, it's an SD case. That's cool. And the last thing in here is a card reader. And then my dad also got me and my sister these necklaces. It's just kind of like rainbow. It's a multi-purpose chain, according to him. Because it comes with like sunglass holder thingies, so you can hold your sunglasses with it. But I don't really need a sunglass holder. Um, you could also wear it as a necklace or a bracelet, I guess, if your wrist fits in there. So I'm probably going to wear it as a necklace. I actually have a romper that this would go really well with that I'm probably going to wear for New Year's. We also just got this picture of us all. And the last thing I got for my dad is actually kind of depressing, so thanks dad. I got socks, which would be fine, except for the fact that they're boot socks, so like for snowboarding and skiing, and I can't snowboard this winter, so we love being injured. And then my cousin, we saw her too, so she got me a few things. She got me this shirt, and it smells like vinegar, but it's fine, we're going to wash it. Oh god, it smells so bad. And it's a Tennessee like jersey, number six. For Camara, because her favorite football team is the Saints, and we actually went to see a Saints game together, and so she found the Saints player that played for Tennessee, which is my college, and had to get me a jersey. And then she also got me this really cute, like, hoodie, which I'm super stoked about. I don't own any hoodies that are, like, full of zips, but lately I've been really wanting one. I'm so excited to have gotten a Tennessee one, and it's super cute because it's white, and I don't have any, like white Tennessee stuff. I mostly just have orange stuff. Okay, that is everything I got for Christmas. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to see some more videos from me in the new year with my new camera that I got for Christmas. I have some ideas in my brain for 2020 and I'm excited to do them. I'll see you next time. Merry Christmas, y'all.